Kalo and Rosie arguing is causing a viscosity in Kalo's mind. A, your appetites be as big as me beard. So are you officially official with anybody online? All I have to do is clean out his memory. Oh well, only temporarily, right doc? Well, there's a small chance he will get them back. But I should warn you, if we don't there's a possibility he'll be stuck like this forever. There could be any fix to this problem. Could Kalu be cursed because one of us offended a witch? Oh, see, now that makes a lot of sense. No, guys I seriously doubt it's a witch. Hold on I figured it out. Oh you found a vengeful witch. It's not a witch. What is it dad? This movie will explain everything. I hope it's Shrek, that donkey is so funny. Hey, this may be our last chance to watch a movie with Kalu so, let's all just quiet down and watch this movie together. Lights off. Oh hello there, you caught me sciencing. I'd like to talk to you about a sensitive but serious issue, brain freezing. Yeah I'm at too. Wait 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 don't leave. I'm scared of the dark. Having this happen to you can be strange, to reverse the effect. Try swimming in a lake near a nuclear power plant. You well, that was a waste so of time. Like Say, does anyone else have anything they want to tell Kalo before I turn on the old fun stick? Uh, no. Okay. Wait. Are you okay? Did it wipe your memory? I don't think so. Did it wipe yours? I'm okay, I know I am. Are you okay? I'm okay. Oh, what a relief. But who are you people? And who am I? There's a microscopic navigational capsule in the middle of the floor. In the middle of where now? It's on the floor. It's just too small for you to see. Back up everyone. Dad, watch out. Dr. Nightski, tell us how to unbreak my dad's brain. We need to reset it, then we'll get it back. How do we reset someone's brain? Yeah, is there like an on-off switch somewhere? Yes, on his hippocampus. Now, we need someone to enter this capsule, get shrunk down and inject it into Boris's head, then pilot the capsule into his brain and deliver an extremely high voltage electrical shock, directly onto his hippocampus. Youch, I'd hate to be this Boris guy. Let's shrink this pod and get into Dad's bod. Leo, is Boris secured? He's good. In three, two, one. Kalo, can you hear me? Uh, yeah? Oh my god it worked. I can't believe it worked. What do you mean you can't believe it worked? There is a 5% chance that it would work. Ten people found that out the hard way. Whoa. Have you never done this before? With a human? With anything? Oh, no I have not. Hey is everything good out there? Yeah yeah, no one's surprised you're alive. I am. What? Nothing. We're going to put you inside Boris's head now. Hey Boris, just gonna put a little drop of water. What's that? I don't want that. I don't know what that is. Hey, look at the guy on my phone. Well. Hello handsome. Okay Caillou. In 20 seconds you have to press the pink button. Countdown. Starting. Now. Okay. Where's the pink button? It's on the table in front of you. This is where somebody messed up at. Dude. They're all pink. One is salmon. One is bubblegum. One is flamingo. <laughs> Running out of time here? Hit the pink button now. Which one is pink? Tell me where pick a corner left right or done or. It's this one. That's pink. Rosie? Ugh, why are boys so bad with colors? Am I right Jasmine? What are you doing here? Yeah what are you doing here? Yeah what are you doing here? As you can see I snuck in here. This ship is bananas. Um, uh, guys. You're at the hippocampus. Emergency stop. You have arrived at your destination. How did you know how to? 
I know what an emergency brake is. What do we do now, Dr. Nitsky? Okay, you have to arm the electrical pulse inducer before you set it. Okay, how do we do that? Press the light blue button on your left hand side. Are you kidding me right now? That's Summer Sky. Swiss Ocean. There you go. There are no oceans in Switzerland who even comes up with these names. We're armed. No, I could stare at you all day. Oops. Okay, the charge is set. Great, now you have two minutes to get out of Boris's head before that charge goes off. Wait, what? Why do we have to get out in two minutes? Well, you don't have to, but if you don't get out of there before the electrical peel inducer goes off, the blast will short out the capsule and you'll be stuck in Boris's head. Forever? Well, no, I mean yes. Dude, why didn't you just make a pulse inducer that detonates remotely? That's a great idea. I'll do that the next time someone's memory gets wiped. Whatever we're on our way, meet us at Borise's left ear. You should have plenty of time. Yeah, you'll be fine, as long as nothing goes wrong. Come on, man. Oh, what's happening? I never thought I'd see you again. Dr. Nightski, there's a bunch of alarms going off and lights blinking. What color lights? Ah, uh, Swiss sky, flamingo ocean they're all blinking Dr. Nightski. Don't worry, there's no need to panic. Ah, uh, there's a tube hanging off the ship and leaking something all over the place. That's the fuel line. Is that bad? Well, no, I mean, yes, you can now panic. Dr. Nightski, there's got to be something we can do to fix this. Well, there is but you have to go outside the capsule and plug the fuel line back in. Okay so how do we do that? First press the release emergency suit button, it's baby bunny pink. How many stupid colorful buttons are there? Found it. Uh, something's going on with Boris. Uh oh, the fuel must be leaking into his brain. I got this. Now Kalo, crawl outside the capsule. I'll go. No I have to go. Calm down Boris you're gonna kill Caillou and Rosie. Who is Boris? Caillou just let your sister go outside and fix the fuel line. No that's my job. I'm gonna risk my life by. Done. What? I fixed it. Let's go. Did you seriously just fix that? How did you fix it so fast? Okay. I will control the capsule from here on out, hold on tight. Got it. Wait Rosie move there. Left. Right. Left right left right left right left right left right left right. Stop. They're in his ear, you have to get them out. How? Use this. What do I do with this? Shove it up his ear and suck them out. Dead, dead, day, ah, yeah. Leo, Dr. Nightski, Dr. Jasmine. What happened to Caillou and Rosie? Hello. Get us out of here. They're, They're alive. alive. Guys, I think I know the cause to why Kalu's brain was affected by this. The cause would have to be a lobster marinated in red eyed mudfish. Big Beards. Rosie. What? Big Beard is just a guy with a glorious beard and a daughter who likes to smell my hair. I say we go down to Big Beards with some duct tape and a duck. Come on, let's go. Uh, table four. Two, please. Leo, right this way. I'm so glad the two of you are back. Especially you, Leo. Now, it be hammer time. Not so fast, Big Beard. Uh-oh, Leo. Something is going on the kitchen. Freeze, the both of you. 
hold on, I was trying to stop him from poisoning people with his ingredients, he's the one you want. Is there be a problem officer? You're coming with me. Kalu, are you okay? Yeah, but we could never resolve my issue about me freezing up. The best thing you can do is try to not get in any fights with Rosie. But don't worry, we're in this together, we're family. Thanks dad. Kalu. What happened? I don't know about you, but I think our combined love fixed my issue where I would freeze. I'm back. I'm actually back. Woo, my son is back.